here. Okay, first, having a good Americana, I find, is invaluable. It sets up all kinds of other stuff. Chin in front, okay, get him turning up onto his side. Reach under, get my, uh, get now important detail, put my hand right into his back, here, okay? Now, I'm gonna let go, I'm still holding his wrist, so he can't fight grips with me, right? I still hold his wrist here, and I grab his knee, push it down under his chin. Before he knows I'm set, the first thing I do is get my knee under his chin. He knows I'm going for a choke in front of his chin. Now, I'm going to reach and make that grab. I want to stick my hook in. He's probably going to try and stop me with this arm, right? So I can lean up and bring his arm at the same time. Put that foot in. Okay, now, I'm going to put my grip to the knee. Fall back on my back. back like this and, and just try and choke him because he's, he's sucking he can bring his head out from underneath the way uh, I'm just showing you the pattern. The way I can stop him from bringing his head underneath is to lift my hips up in the air so I can just change the angle that he's on. So really bring his hips up. Sorry. Yeah, I can't stop him. Brutal. Right? But when I bring his hips up, it brings his head up in the air and then my arm comes more behind his neck. And then there's no way he's wiggling his head. Side mount. I mean, I can get get here a few different ways. Turns on the side to protect. Step. Get my chest behind. Lock up my straight jacket here. Now watch my details here. This book comes in behind. Just a little extra roadblock. A little. Something else that's stopping him from getting flat to his back. Because once he gets flat to his back, I can't choke him. I want to keep him up on his side, turned away from him. Push the gi underneath his chin. Reach and grab. I don't even do it too tight. Okay? So now I want to get my foot over to the other side of his body. Okay? I can pull this arm up. Pull it right up if I need to, to get that leg across. Grab the knee. Okay? And now. Just, I still have my foot tucked right into his back where it was before. Okay, and I just lay down on it. I pull him on top of my leg until my foot comes free. free. I come over the top of the shoulder, lock my feet together, and the first thing I do is not try and choke him, is lift my hips up in the air. Hips up, and then put a little pressure on his neck to choke him. 